Hey guys, welcome, it's Rob Boyd here coming from the DevNet Zone. It is my pleasure to be joined by Andrew from Unified FX and also Rick from DevNet. So let's start with you, Rick. Uh, as I understand it, DevNet Zone's been growing every year, but help me understand exactly what is happening here and what do we need to understand? Rob, the DevNet Zone that we do at Cisco Live every year is our biggest developer conference within Cisco Live. So this is where we expo expose all our technologies and platforms for developers to come learn and play, and I emphasize play because we've got a lot of hands-on stuff with some of the key technologies and platforms that uh, really we, we want to draw the developers in to come check out these platforms, learn, play, and then develop and innovate on top of Cisco technology. But it really is about uh, something broader than just DevNet Zone. DevNet is something that happens for anyone that couldn't physically be here. There's still ways for them to take advantage? That's true. Developer.cisco.com is the place where developers can go if they can't get here. Or even if they're here, that's where they go to continue on the journey. In addition, we're also at Cisco Lives in Asia and Australia. Cisco Live in Berlin coming up uh, in Europe. Uh, is another one that we're going to be at. And we go to other events like the World uh, IoT Forum and places. So DevNet goes on the road. So you guys are driving software development, but it's broader than even just DevNet. I mean, the things that Cisco's doing to drive the idea of uh, software and ISVs and such, help me understand that. This transition to a software company is very important to Cisco, and so we have some very key technologies we're highlighting here at DevNet. Uh, one is IoT, the Internet of Things, which is a big technology that's coming on board. Uh, Software-defined networks is the second one. Third is cloud is very big, and then collaboration has always been very, very important to us. We've had a big developer community uh, involved in that technology. Now I would also say, it's more than just DevNet as you said, because once developers come and they develop on our platforms, many of these developers, the ISVs, want to go to market. So we also have the solution partner program in our marketplace, and that's how we help get our tech, the technologies and the innovation that's written on top of the DevNet platforms can get exposed to our customers out there through the Solution Partner Program. And that sort of go-to-market uh, component is very, very important to our developers and our customers. That's excellent. So you guys are really looking at the entire life cycle and big and small developers, it's all about what can we create together? Yes. How can we drive that market? Thank you, Rick, thank you so much. Okay. Speaking of collaboration, I believe, Andrew, you guys with Unified FX are doing collaboration and a whole lot more. Can you help me explain what you guys are up to here? Yeah, sure. Uh, we're Unified FX and we specialize in Cisco phone endpoint management. So that's a whole collaboration scheme. We are all in. We are uh, solutions partners. We promote a product through the Cisco marketplace. Uh, in the development of our product, we use lots of software and all the APIs that Cisco provide. Uh, once we've got it all developed, we need to find somewhere to test it all properly, and that's where we get really heavily involved with the DevNet team. Uh, DevNet team have got a solutions testing sandbox, which is a really excellent uh, device for us to use to test our software to a bit of scale. Uh, however, while we were doing that, we got very close to the uh, Cisco team, and they really liked what our software did and thought maybe this could be used as part of the technology within the sandbox that lets other ISVs test their collaboration applications, but not required to have the telephones and on the desktop next to them, but they could be remotely stored in the sandbox, but still control them the same way. Excellent, so it's a good example of partners working together to drive solutions. Certainly appreciate you guys taking the time to be here. Guys, that's it for DevNet. Hey guys, that about wraps it up here for DevNet at Cisco Live. There's so much to see, so much to do, so much to, to play with. You guys have got to come check this out and get hands-on here at DevNet. I'm going to do that right now.